Hello and welcome to Oracle Database at Google Cloud Monitoring Session. Oracle Exadata VM Cluster and Container Database Metrics are integrated into Google Cloud Monitoring. I'll show you how easily you can build custom dashboard and detect alerts, everything from Google Cloud Console. So let's get started. To build a custom dashboard, log into Google Cloud Console. From there, you can search for monitoring in the search box or using the hamburger menu. If you have already pinned it, you can directly navigate to monitoring. From here, select dashboard. Select create dashboard. Add widget. Select the visualization that you want. Now, we have to select the metrics from the dropdown. To build the dashboard, on the Exadata VM cluster, select Cloud VM cluster. We are going to add CPU utilization and hit apply. Now, on your right hand side corner, you will find the apply button. Select that one. Your first widget is added. Repeat the same steps and add more widget to add more metrics into your dashboard. Once your dashboard is populated with all the required metrics, put a name of your dashboard. For our demo, I have already built a dashboard. So let's navigate and select that one. Exadata VM cluster resource utilization. Here, you will be able to add filter if you have more than one cluster. So we are going to put a filter on Cloud VM Cluster ID. From here, we are going to select our Demo VM Cluster 01. You will be able to select the window that you want to troubleshoot. Here, we are going to pick the last 12 hours. To build a custom dashboard on container databases, Follow the same process that you have followed for the Exadata VM cluster, except when you are adding the widget, you just need to pick a different matrix from the dropdown. Find container database, select that one, and in the container database, you will find all the available metrics. Choose from there, and your container database resource utilization dashboard will be ready. To monitor pluggable database metrics, log into Oracle Cloud Infrastructure OCI Console. On your pluggable database management window, you will find an option to enable database management feature for your pluggable database. Once it is enabled, you will be able to find the metrics and here you will have many options to select the window. To create alerting, navigate back to the Container Database Resource Utilization Dashboard. From here, select the metrics on which you want to enable the alerting. In our case, we are going to select the Container Database CPU Utilization. Find the bell icon, select it. We are going to put a filter on the Container Database name. So in our case, our container database is Demo 23 AI. Now select a rolling window, let's say five minutes, and we are going to say next. In the configure alert trigger, for the condition type, select threshold, and in the threshold value, type 80, select next. Select a notification channel, and put a name. And we have also option to select the criticality of this alert. So in our case, when the CPU reaches 80%, we are going to call it critical. Select next. Select create policy. After your alerting policies are created, navigate to alerting. Here you will be able to find the incidents which were triggered as part of the policy you just enabled. With this, we conclude today's monitoring session. I hope you enjoyed the session. Thank you.